Well, good morning, everyone. It is day eight, and I'm almost into Bilbao. You're saying, what? The sun's up? And it's 6.45, and I haven't started walking yet. Yeah, that's right. Um, I only have about six miles into town, so I decided that I'm going to enjoy the breakfast here this morning. Uh, that should be served in about a half hour. And then I'll pack up and leave. I should be on the road by um, 8 o'clock, maybe 8.30 at the latest. And that'll get me in town um, certainly before noon. It's going to be really, really hot. It's starting to get hot up here, um, 96, 97 today. And then the next few days, it's going to be up um, in the hundreds. So glad I'm taking a few rest days in Bilbao. Uh, spoke with Gigi last night. Uh, you'll get to meet her. And uh, she'll be meeting me there uh, tomorrow. So let's go see what they have for breakfast, shall we? Well, that was a very pleasant breakfast. The sun is up. I can tell it's gonna get really hot today. So have the uh, hat on from the beginning. And uh, like I said, only about six miles, so not too bad. Well, this is a nice uh, change of pace from the urban sidewalk and uh, hugging an industrial area. So for the next uh, about four kilometers, maybe five, we'll be going up a hill. And from what I've been told and what I've read, it is to give the first view of Bilbao and it is supposed to be beautiful. It's kind of a shame I wasn't there uh, for sunrise but I really wanted to sleep in this morning.
Well, this is gonna be interesting. So there's a diversion and just like the other day, my map function went out. So I hope this is marked somewhat well, but I know I'm going in the right general direction. So let's see what happens. Okay, well that wasn't too bad. Back to it. Well, I made it to Bilbao. Uh, it took a little bit longer than I thought it would getting through the city. Um, you know, it's always complicated with the city streets. There was one section, uh, did you see that with all the stairs? Wow. But I found my pension. Uh, it is a little too early to check in, but the lady at the reception desk was very nice and allowed me to leave my bag in a secure spot. So I'll go back in about two hours, she said, and my room should be ready. In the meantime, I am going to enjoy sitting in the square, maybe having a little vino and some pinchos, walking around uh, for a bit, and I will see you later.
Okay, I really have no idea what this is, other than the fact it has a jalapeno on the top. So, let's cut in and see what it has. So, it's some type of a, kind of a sweet and tangy meat inside. Um, I'm gonna have to figure out what it is because it's really tasty, has, a little burn at the front, but then it's sweet. So, um, kind of like a Chinese barbecue bun, um, but with a little bit of a, a tang to it. So as you can see and hear, the square is filling up. It is uh, about 7.20 and everybody is getting ready for their evening meal. Um, it has been a wonderful day of pinchos. <laughs> <laughs> and um, just walking around the city, I've toured the cathedral um, and the basilica today. I did a little shopping, so stay tuned for tomorrow. Uh, sampled some lovely um, local wines and the pinchos here. Oh, just amazing. So, I'm going to um, finish my wine and call it a night. Um, fortunately tonight my room is not on the city street nor does it have a window facing any other noise so I think I'm going to get a really good night's sleep tonight. Gigi should be here by uh, early afternoon and we're going to start touring the area. Uh, this should be fun. Again, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. If you have any questions, any suggestions, anything you would like to know about this journey, please let me know. It is getting muy caliente, very hot. Um, so I'm looking ahead to see what I might do when I do leave Bilbao. Uh, it's looking to be about 101. I don't know if I want to tackle the hills or go by the coast or maybe just take the metro to my next...